tonight we're going to Madrid. Flight time tonight, six hours, 32 minutes. Every team is allowed uh, every four years to take a foreign trip. Um, you know, for me, I wanted this trip, I wanted it to be used for a number of different things. You know, not only to improve as a basketball team, because that's a big advantage. You know, the other thing that it can do really well is it can be a great team bonding experience. How, how big soccer is really like over here. Um, it's, it's even bigger than our football back in America. So, you know, going to Real Madrid Stadium and seeing all the stuff they have in their museums and locker room, even the field is kind of like ridiculous. This is nice. This is nice. The games are fun, you know, but the fact that we got to come down here, like all the memories I got to spend with my teammates and the bonding moments, those opportunities are like once in a lifetime. I don't really think many people get to ever do that, you know, so I think that's what I really take back with me. You know, we're basically spending all the time with us, you know, with everyone else and, you know, our families and each other. You know, while other teams are kind of at home, they're kind of away from basketball, kind of chilling out, you know, we spent the 10 extra days practicing. And now we got to come here for 10 more days. So it's all like we're really getting to learn each other and we're really building a lot of chemistry. I was not good at Spanish in high school. Uh, if I need to speak Spanish, I'll talk to Gavin. And I'll let him speak. He's, uh, he's pretty fluent, or he thinks he is. So it's, uh, you know, it's one of Gavin's. Kinks to him. Um, yes. Um, yes. Okay. You know, a lot of people don't really get to go out of the country, but let alone for us to go to Spain and go to four different cities. And get to tour the places we got to go to, like Real Madrid and Barcelona, and it's just really, it's really an awesome experience. I like the trip a lot. I think it really helped us with, you know, basketball, and you know, trying to learn and get our team together for the season. <laughs> Good. <laughs> It's 
through all of our strength and conditioning and you know extra running and on the court and the workouts and the practices and our trip to Spain and you know this is our family. You can be ready, you can know you're ready, you can be excited and all those things, but until you're put in that chair, until you sit on that bench and you're faced with decisions you have to make, you're faced with the things that you have to do to run a program, um, you can't get better until you go through it. No matter where this program goes, and we know it's going in the right direction, that they're going to be a part of something, um, building a foundation. And you definitely, I mean, want to be that team, and you want to be a part of that team. I've been really happy with the steps we've taken towards defending at a high level. That's the step where we need to continue, you know, walking that path. I'm like ready for the season. <laughs> I cannot wait for the season to start. The excitement in this program is probably as high as it's ever been, and I'm happy about that. I want people to feel that we're on the verge of doing good things. To me, the word potential means you haven't done anything. So that means you got work to do.